After 60 years of space activities, there are around 29,000 human-made objects larger than 10 centimeters orbiting around Earth. Some operational, most dead. The vast majority of these objects drift freely in orbit, at risk of collision. A one centimeter object could strike a working satellite with the force of an exploding hand grenade. Any collision would create more debris, which can lead in turn to a cascade of further collisions. As the total space launches per year go on increasing, the situation will only grow worse. ESA is leading efforts to tackle the problem of space debris. This includes developing technologies to actively remove debris, focused on a demonstrator mission called ED Orbit. ED Orbit will target a derelict ESA-owned satellite in a heavily trafficked low orbit to capture it, then bring it down to burn up in the atmosphere. Such a mission will mark a world first. There are three kind of challenges to overcome. The first is to identify the target as it tumbles out of control, then find a safe way to close in, then synchronize orbital paths. The second challenge is to actually capture it in a secure way. Two alternative mechanisms are currently under study. One would use a robotic arm, the other would employ a net. The final challenge will be to convey this massive item of debris down in a safe and controlled manner. ED Orbit will be the world first act of active debris removal. The mission will position European industry in the global lead of this emerging space market. Success will pave the way in turn for the creation of whole new market sectors and follow-on services.